Hello and welcome to another video from Paraplays and in today's video we're going to be looking at another piece of tech, another gadget, another gizmo, something else that's kind of cropped up within my airsoft journey and today we're going to be looking at the Peltors. Well in fact these are actually the Peltor XPIs. Now with all things in airsoft when you're out there there's always a piece of kit, a piece of tech something that just looks damn Gucci when you see other people on the field playing with and you think what's that why are they wearing them and what's the use of that are they just wearing it because it looks good or does it actually have any functionality well today as I mentioned we're going to be looking at the Pelto XPIs and I'm going to be telling you what I think of these and what's the actual point of wearing these for airsoft so the official blurb is these are specifically designed for military personnel to help reduce exposure to hazardous levels of noise. I think flashbangs, grenades, loud noises, bombs, etc. And they're supposed to improve situational awareness and at the same time they enable two-way radio communication in noisy environments. This product is also compatible with other military gear like helmets and protective vests. And the Comtat XPI is a fully independent dual e-phone system from talk through and external radio signals it's designed to be worn comfortably under a helmet be used with different kinds of weapons without being in the way and at the same time protect effectively against harmful noise levels so as you can see on screen here we've actually got the XPIs in front of us and they really are quite a nice solidly built thing this is where the actual headset goes in to your uh, push to talk button which will then go to your radios which I may cover in another video actually but they are quite expensive for the downlink and as you can see it's all connected here so these really are brilliant for being able to communicate on the bottom we have the on button and there are multiple settings in here such as advanced tones uh, sensitivity uh, volume you, you, there's lots of settings in there which probably me and you as playing airsoft is really not going to need to be honest with you the two microphones you can see here on the front actually produce a really loud audio in the headphones of a 360 degrees all the way around you and it's like amplified by about 10 times. So what that means is when you put these on you can communicate and talk to people perfectly. In fact you can hear a lot better with them on than when you haven't got them on. And if I'm standing still in the woods, you can hear a twig break at about <laughs> 20, 30, probably even further out meters, you can hear it click you can hear people moving around in the underbrush moving through trees walking on ferns and, and uh, pine cones and things like that so these really are a massive advantage actually especially if you're going to be doing milsim you can be stood completely still and you can hear the enemy moving around in the woods or just talking or rustling you know keep moving from quite a long way away they're actually designed, they're curved under at the bottom of the earphone, which means you've got plenty of room to put these on under a helmet. Look at me, fucking gormless. You can put them on under your helmet. They're really quite comfortable to wear for a long time. I've worn these for about six hours during the day. I actually need to move these a little bit up so the mic is pointing a little bit further forward. But you get the idea. And they're also, because they're curved at the bottom, means you have actually got room to shoulder your weapon and it gives you a little bit more maneuverability. You can actually get your weapon in there rather than the bulk at the bottom on a normal set of headphones. It's not really going to be viable for me to be able to show you what these actually sound like without sticking a microphone in the earpiece. But what I can tell you is if you've got the money and you're prepared to put down the dollar, I mean these were about £150 on eBay, but they do cost a lot more if you buy them from the official sites and including the actual downlink which is the boom microphone that comes around to the front down the vest and the PTT you're looking at an extra 150 to 80 so that you're looking at nearly 350 400 pounds in some places so it is expensive it's one of those little luxuries that if you want to get into the proper mill sim brilliant whether this is any good for skirmishing is probably a little bit OTT but being able to communicate with two or three of your friends when you're out there, you're all in a line, you can talk to each other about where the enemy is, they are fantastic and they really were a great purchase and I love enjoying... <coughs> I really do enjoy using them and I can't recommend these highly enough if you've got the dollar, get some and run around and be fucking Gucci like I am. Thanks for watching, I've been Paraplays, coughing my bloody guts up. I shall see you in another video coming real soon.